Hi everyone, I'm Steve Sabin. Welcome to this segment of Exploring Setpoint. Today we'd like to talk a little bit more about our Setpoint condition monitoring software. One of the questions that comes up very frequently is what type of plots will I be able to see in the Setpoint CMS software? And the answer is all the ones that you need to do machinery diagnostics. Initially the Setpoint software will be released in the June-July time frame and your navigation to various types of data is primarily going to be done through the uh, Pi Process Book interface where you can select a particular group of machines, where you can drill down to a particular machine train, and you can select points. Once you get down to the level of selecting a particular point or a group of points, then you can begin to drill down into specific plot types. As you probably know, Pi Process Book was designed to look at process data, so it's very good at displaying trends, at statuses, uh, and other types of real-time data. It really was not designed initially to store or display high-speed waveforms. Well, with Setpoint CMS software, what we've been able to do is use the Pi Historian as a repository for this high-speed waveform data, and use our Setpoint CMS software as a visualization tool to actually see that data. So you can see the time base, the orbit, the spectrum, and those kinds of displays. The, the initial release of the product in the June-July timeframe will be using process book to navigate down to the specific point that you'd like to look at. Then you can click on the point and you'll be able to say, would I like to look at a trend? Would I like to look at a time base? Would I like to look at an orbit? or any other kind of waveform data that's associated with that point. And at that point, you will be moving into the Setpoint CMS software, which will launch and will display that particular data. Initially, we will have orbits and time-based type displays. We'll have spectrums. We'll have Baudet plots. We'll have shaft centerline. We'll have trending. And we will also have polar plots. Uh, several months after that initial release, we will introduce uh, the ability to do multivariable trending and we'll also be enhancing the software so that if you don't want to start out in your Pi process book interface to actually navigate to the points, you'll be able to do all of that from the Setpoint CMS software. So there'll really be two environments that you can use to navigate to the data of interest. You can use Pi process book, which many operators and others in the plant are very used to because that's the system they're using to visualize their process data. And you'll have the Setpoint CMS software, which is typically what uh, machinery specialists and rotating uh, diagnosticians uh, will use to analyze the vibration waveforms and decide what root cause of problems might be. So we're looking forward to the release of this software and all of its powerful capabilities. Uh, that initial release will be in the June-July time frame and then you can look forward to a, a continuing series of enhancements after that. Thank you for joining us for Exploring Setpoint and we hope to see you on our next segment.